Well, welcome back, everyone. We have Sergeant Nick Bowes in the studio today from the Lima Highway Patrol. Welcome, Nick. Yeah, thanks for having me. And we're going to be talking about winter safety on the roads, which is definitely important to talk about this time of the year. Absolutely. So I was just doing a little statistic for everyone here. It says during the winter of 22 to 23, there was there were 10,256 crashes on snow, ice, or slush-covered roads in Ohio alone. So that's a lot of crashes. That's pretty significant. Yeah, so talk to us a little bit about um, some safety measures. You know, obviously you want to keep your distance, you know, if the roads are bad. So what else? Uh, absolutely. Um, I would recommend that you slow it down. If, if you think that there's even a possibility the roads are, are bad, they're ice or snow, mm -hmm. um, definitely slow it down. Um, during the winter, you, you want to give yourself more time to get to where you're going. Um, if, you, if you plan on it, if it takes 15 minutes to get somewhere and you only give them 15 minutes, that, that bad road conditions will add that extra time. That's right. And also, like, is keep in mind of bridges and um, overpasses, those, those do ice up quicker, right? Absolutely. Those are usually the first things to go. Um, ODOT does a pretty good job of trying to get out there and get those things taken care of right away, but... They can only go as fast as they can go. Yeah. And then for something that maybe people may not even think about or, you know, but maybe like some sort of a safety kit to keep in the car, what kind of stuff would they, should they keep in their car? Uh, during the cold days like, like it is right now, uh, it's a good idea to keep an extra blanket. It's a good idea. Um, just, just things that keep you warm, mm -hmm. if you will. Kind of a winter car kit. Mm -hmm. You know, I was, I don't know if this is true or not, but I always heard that you should keep kitty litter in your trunk just in case like you get stuck in the snow you can dump the kitty litter down and it helps you get out that's not a bad idea <laughs> so you never know that might be a good one also um checking your car of course you know for make sure everything that works you know uh maybe like the defroster um make sure that's good make sure that your tires are good you have the proper tread mm -hmm. uh depth that you need for the winter make sure you have the proper air in your tires i mean th those things are very important yeah and also also maybe just like make sure your battery's okay. And, you know, that's something that's definitely important, especially because the cold weather is, is, uh, can be uh, a little damaging on the batteries, I think, and the wipers especially. Absolutely. Yeah. And then if you do find yourself stranded, you know, of course, you want to make sure that your cell phone is charged. Almost everybody carries a cell phone these days, but, you know, make sure it's charged. But if they are stranded, like, how do they call for help? Is there a number that they should call? Yep. Uh, you can call pound six seven seven, or you can uh, go ahead and just look us up online. Every individual post for the area um, has our numbers online. Yeah. What is pound six seven seven? Okay. It sends you to our hub if you will, and then they'll, they'll get you uh, to the correct dispatch center. Right. So, like I said, winter safety on the roads. You know, it says keeping, let's go through the recap a little bit here. So keep a safe distance, allow some extra time, as you said. You know, pay close attention to bridges and, and overpasses. They might ice over a little bit more. Um, make sure that your car is up to date with the battery services are good, your tires, the wipers. Um, you also mentioned carrying a winter car kit, which I think that's very important, you know, because if you're stuck, you're stuck. <laughs> you absolutely, absolutely. You don't know how long it's going to take for help to get there. Exactly. And then if you do find yourself stranded, you said there was a number to call, and that was dial what number? A pound 677. 677. Anything else that you could maybe recommend while you're here uh, just, for our viewers? Just slow it down during these winter months. Uh, don't drive distracted and always wear a safety belt. All right. Well, thank you, Nick, for joining us today. I really do appreciate it giving us tips on winter safety while we're out on the road. So thank you once again. Hey, thanks for having me. All right, well, don't go away because we have more when we return.